guys welcome back to my channel today is tuesday november 19th so i'm going to be vlogging as much as i can today and just continue baby watch until i go into labor i am cooking some lunch right now i'm making some ravioli jj's snacking he's probably gonna go down for a nap here in a little bit it's only like 11 15 but we had to go this morning and, and he had to get some updated shots so he has just been laying on the couch like snacking on goldfish since we got home because he always just is really tired and doesn't feel the best after he gets shots, which I totally understand. So he's kind of just been chilling out, but it is another rainy day. It's like pouring rain outside. It has been all morning. So we're literally just gonna be like doing nothing today. I have no plans. I don't really feel like doing much. I am 39 weeks and five days pregnant today. So literally like right there, I could go into labor anytime now. And let me tell you, I am just like ready to go into labor. All I wanna do is lay on the couch, eat ice chips and do nothing. So that's probably what we're gonna do today. There are a few things I'd like to get done, but it just kinda depends on how I feel. I am really hoping that labor is very, very near because last night I started to feel really bad i got really nauseated and just kind of kind of felt like i was like overheated and i was having some contractions and i was having heartburn and just like all these things at once so i felt like miserable and then i just got this overwhelming feeling that like labor was coming soon and i just got like terrified for labor not necessarily that i don't want to go into labor because obviously i'm ready to go into labor any time now but just like all the things that go along with labor all of the pain and everything like I just got so scared and I was like oh my gosh I don't know if I'm ready for this again so I did lose my mucus plug today which is kind of gross so I'm sorry if that's like TMI for you guys but I am hoping that that's a good sign and that means that I'm gonna go into labor pretty soon <laughs> bundled up we're about to go for a walk it is the next day actually yesterday after JJ got up from his nap we literally did nothing except like lay on the couch and then when Fred got home from work we went and got dinner and then just like chilled out the rest of the night because I'm just not up for like doing a lot lately so we haven't really been doing anything but it's actually not raining this morning so JJ and I are gonna go for a walk try to get this baby out because I am like over pregnancy right now. Thankfully, this is Fred's last day of work. 
even if I don't have the baby, he's starting his leave tomorrow and then he'll pretty much be off until like Christmas, New Year's time. So thankfully this is the last day, just me and JJ because it is so rough and JJ is just acting pretty crazy these days. having a little early lunch. We just got back. He already ate his hot dog, so now he's eating his mac and cheese. Okay, now So I just got out of the shower, as you guys can probably tell. I needed to wash my hair like so bad. It has been like days since I've actually washed my hair. So I really needed to do that. JJ got up from his nap and he was snacking and watching TV. So I hopped in the shower really quick. And I've also just been kind of spending the afternoon cleaning up a little bit. I like mopped the floors and vacuumed and I needed to spot treat the carpet a little bit because between JJ and all the rain and the dogs, our carpet gets so dirty so quickly. So. I did all that real quick so that everything is just nice and clean for when we come home from the hospital and my mother-in-law is flying in tomorrow, which I'm really excited about. I know JJ is gonna have so much fun having her here and it's gonna be just really nice having like family around because as you guys know, we're military and, and pretty much all of our family is literally like on the other side of the country. So <laughs> we rarely ever see them, so I'm really excited for her to come visit and stay with us for a couple of weeks. But I briefly mentioned it earlier that today is Fred's last day of work, which I am so excited about. He gets a certain amount of days for paternity leave normally. And normally that wouldn't start until after I get home from the hospital after I deliver, but they are gonna let him start it a little bit early. So today was his last day of work. And so he's gonna be off until Christmas, which I am so excited about. So he'll get his paternity leave and then he's gonna take some like extra days so that JJ's over here playing with the toilet. What are you doing? Anyways, like I was saying, I'm really excited that he's gonna have like a whole month off because I feel so bad for JJ lately because I just don't have it in me to like go out and do anything with him. And when I do, he just throws like the worst tantrums. Like he has been acting out so much more than normal. I think he just knows that something's coming and something's changing. So we've pretty much just been like in the house watching TV and playing with his cars and stuff like all week long. So I'm really happy that Fred's gonna be home so he can like take JJ out and do things with him. And then my mother-in-law's coming. So of course she will be able to play with him like nonstop, which I know he's gonna love. But I am just so happy that Fred has a job where he can take off that much time and be home with us. So I'm really, really excited for that. And worst case, she will be here the end of next week at the latest. If I don't go into labor by 41 weeks, they will induce me. So that's the latest she will be here, but I really think she's gonna come before then. So any day now, she can come whenever she is ready because oh my goodness, I know that I am ready for her to get here already. But I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. Fred will be heading home here soon. So I'll start cooking dinner here in just a little bit. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you're not already, and I'll see you guys very soon in my next video. Bye.